Hi, we want to talk about tables and especially about text flow break. So we have here some text, some tables, and I want, I don't want to come this table between some text. I want the table to come uh, here on the next page and the same on the second, on the third page, I want uh, that page to begin with a table. So let's um, let's go to this table, right click here, and we have table properties. From here we have text flow. So here there are some tabs and we choose text flow break. We want a page break, a new page or a column. We'll talk about, uh, first about page. We want a new page before this table. Okay, so I have this page break here, a new, a new page beginning with this table. So the text is interrupting and the uh, table is moving on the next page because I said so. Let's do the same thing here. I want this table, I want a page break, a new page before this table. So before this table to open, I want a new page. So first I have a new page and after that I have the table. The same thing here. So I have three pages with three tables. Let's see the other options. Okay, you can see here the page break on the table. Now let's see the page break after. So after my table, I want not, nothing, not any text, I want a page break. So you can see I have no text here and I have a page break. No text and here first I have a page break. After that, I have the rest of the text that was before. The same, I want after this table, a page break and no text and the same thing here. Okay, let's... Um, I have no text here, okay? I have a page break. I have no text below. I have a page break. Okay, let's uncheck everything and let's um, do everything like before in order to see other things. So let's uncheck that. Now let's see another option that we have. But for that, we need um, the page to be formatted in columns. So let's choose uh, two columns on the same page. So I have a page like this. And I don't want uh, this table to begin here down. I want the table to begin in the top of the page. So after a column break. So I check a break. I want a column break, not a page break. And I want, I want this before the table. So I have the column that I have I have the page break and that I ha then I have the table. So this way, now I want a reverse. I want after, after the table, I want nothing. Let's remove some text from here. You could see the text is not moving from here because I said I don't want anything here down. So here I said nothing up, nothing up here, nothing down. Because here I checked, after after that I want a page break, I don't want anything. If I check like um, the other tables, I have everything uh, down. So very easy to use. Uh, thanks for watching. Um, please subscribe uh, for this channel because every week we have new videos. Thank you.